for us the sin is a shame so we don't expose it if it's in secret you don't expose it and if one is exposing his sin or her sin exposing it then you must warn people from them one who exposes their sin has revealed has taken away the cover of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala off them in another hadith the Rasul sallallahu alayhi wa sallam said مَا زَالَ أُمَّتِي مُعَافًا إِلَّا الْمُجَاهِرُونَ my ummah, each member of my ummah is at peace, is protected, except the ones who expose their sins, who love to, who love to what? Expose them, as in who love to tell people about their sins and they feel proud about them, they feel good about it. That's the difference. The difference between saying to a person, I've done a sin, feeling ashamed to get advice, or to advise someone, you know, don't do what I did. But what Rasulullah means those who say it out happily and they're proud of it. Ah, oh, did you see me? I got her number. I got her number and I spoke to her the other night. Oh, and I've hooked myself up, bro. I'm going to meet her tomorrow. And they feel proud of it. This is haram sin. Hey, I tried out alcohol the other day. Shh, my dad doesn't know about it. Just keep it between me and you. He says, wow, man, you're courageous. You're sick, man. And then you become what? They, they feel like they're proud that they've done this to win their peers sort of respect. That's what they think or to become popular. My favorite music is Lady Gaga. I love listening to Lady Gaga or Akon is my favorite singer. Ah, oh, the latest r and So hey, listen, listen, I, I can sing it. Don't tell my mom and dad that I'm into this stuff, man. Because I also took, took drugs the other night, but don't tell them. You know, so sins. Rasul tells us don't expose your sins out of happiness and even don't expose them if there's no need to expose them because it gives other people the idea.